<clears throat> All right. Let's go to Ephesians 4 and 31. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. So let all bitterness and wrath and anger and clamor and evil speaking be put away from you with all malice. So let all bitterness. What does bitterness mean? Okay, let's go to it. Bitterness, the second definition is anger and disappointment at being treated unfairly, resentment. So, you are feeling angry because of how someone treated you. So let's say resentment to make it more easier. Okay. So let all resentment and wrath what is wrath let's look it up wrath is extreme anger okay so let all resentment and extreme anger and anger <laughs> and clamor what does clamor mean let's look it up clamor is a loud and confused noise especially that of people shouting vehemently. So like an argument. Okay. So let all resentment and extreme anger and anger and arguments and evil speaking. So you are talking crazy to people or really rude or mean or you are saying mean things to people so on and so on be put away from you with all malice so what does malice mean malice is the intention or desire to do evil ill will so you are planning on doing something really bad so let all resentment and extreme anger and anger and clamor, which is what? Like arguments, right? And evil speaking, so you are being really rude or saying mean things about people, slandering people, stuff like that, be put away from you with all malice. Malice meaning you are intending to do bad things. I pray that this makes sense. So this is pretty much telling you, get rid of your bitterness, your resentment. Stay away from extreme anger. Or if you do get angry, don't be angry for long. Don't be arguing. Don't slander people. Don't say mean and rude things to people. Don't do that. And don't intend or contemplate on doing evil. I pray that this makes sense. God bless.